Hello everyone, you are welcome and you are watching Bypass Tech Draw. Today I'm going to show you and to teach you how to use HTML as standard for a standard for hypertext makeup language. We will see in different series. This is episode one, which is called Introduction to HTML. Now, what is HTML? As I said, HTML is stands for Hypertext Makeup Language. And as it is standard for, it's a makeup language for creating web pages like this one. This one is a website called negut.com and it contains with different web pages. HTML will help you to create a page like this. Okay. HTML describes the structure of web pages and it consists of a series of alignment. In the future, I will explain to you what is an element and why you use it. An element tells a browser how to display the content. Yes, like this. Yeah, this is P, is an element, or sometimes we say is an a tag, a tag, which um, used to make a paragraph. Yes. This is an element that tells the browser how to display a content in form of paragraph. Okay, an, H an HTML element label, piece of the content such as in heading, like paragraph, and the link etc. Okay, why? What is the use of HTML? Uh, HTML stands for Hypertext Makeup Language, yes, it is, and it allows the user to create and the structure section, sections, paragraph, headings, links, and block quotes for the web pages and, and applications. Okay. Uh, in the future, or if you watch this series, you will be able to be a web developer if you follow in this series. First, if you didn't make a subscribe on this channel, you can make it and it has continued on this on this introduction. Okay. You can ask yourself what an HTML is used today? Yes, it is used. Yeah. Today we use uh, HTML5, it's the latest standard, uh, it's the latest version of standard of HTML. Yes, this is an example of HTML code. Okay, you see, uh, this is the instruction line or instruction codes. Uh, I will show you how to make it and how to write it. Yes, this you can write these codes by using many different tools. I will show you uh, some of them. Okay, an example uh, example explained uh, the, that element or tags. First, let us start, start with this this HTML. Is an element root an element of an HTML pages. Uh, second one is called head. This head contains with meta tags information about the HTML page. Yes, it contains the different information of the page. Okay, title. This title is an element specifies the type of HTML pages. I will show you. Okay, the body. This defines the document body. And it contains with different tags like paragraph, images, hyperlinks, tables, list, etc. Yes, uh, H1. This is defined a large heading. 
we will see there are h1 h2 h3 which is which is the type of uh, heading uh, we have the uh, other one called p this is defined the paragraph as i as i said before okay html element uh, is uh, defined by the tags it is defined by the tags yeah tags is um, uh, for example this h1 this h1 is a, a an element of a tag there okay that is what we call an element element is the same as sometimes we say is the same as tag okay uh, you can make uh, your own your own web page by using the following tools okay you can use a uh, text editor by writing codes like sublime text notepad plus plus and vs code you can use everything you want if you want to to download one of the them you can you can download it on the internet okay second one you can use a browser by for testing the output yes you can test your instruction code or your written codes by testing it by using the browser okay this is an example of an output of the previous code that you, I was showing you on the last minute. Yes, this is the first program, my first heading. This is the output of that um, that codes I was showing you. Okay, let us let us try to write an HTML code that will print this this output. Okay. Let us try to let us try to write the codes. Okay. First of all, we open the Sublime Text. Me, I, I using this Sublime Text. Let me writing the text size. Okay. Let's start with um, first. You must able to save to save uh, your document. Uh, I click Control Save in Windows. Uh, you are, or you are able to use uh, this save button and let us go to where we can save it and ok it let us name it as index.html html every html pages must be able to have this extension of dot html ok let us start with start with html HTML, okay. We, uh, I was showing you. This is the HTML codes, okay. This HTML is the tag. Let me. Okay, this is uh, an HTML that will hold, that hold the. Uh, every codes in the document okay this is head contains with all all information about the page and this title uh, show the the title of 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 page well, let us say home page page okay Yes, uh, and this body is a tag called body or element called body. Uh, this will define all the body or the document. 
uh, and we can put the all contents in, inside this this body. Okay, let I put the some element. Okay, let's say these, these, this is uh, the heading. This is the heading. Okay, and let's put the paragraph. Paragraph. This is. This is paragraph. This is the paragraph. Okay. If you want to text it, first you need to save. You need to save, and then right click on this notepad press press and open in browser. Let us see what the output we get. Wow. This is the output. This is our heading. Okay, then we minimize this. And okay, this is the output we get first. Now, I hope you understand how to use these HTML and how to save it, and how and what is those element means okay the next episode uh, we will see how to to style the page or to style text and how to formatting it how to comment the codes and why we use uh, why we need a uh, comment and how to make colors in the web pages and thank you very much if, if you didn't make subscribe you can make it and if you get some problem or get some question you can come you can put it in the comment thank you very much ciao